what's up guys welcome back to another video now in today's video i want to do something different than my regular videos if you've seen any of my past videos you would know i do more vlog style videos but today i want to do more of a sit down type of video and give you guys my top five mods under 500 bucks for your honda civic tension now i do want to start this video by saying this is all opinion based so if you don't agree with me on something that's totally fine we all have our own likes we all have our own taste this is just my opinion. Hopefully you find something on this list that you like and possibly install, or maybe you already have. So if you do, go ahead and leave a like down below. All right, and also none of these items are in any particular order. They're just whatever pretty much coming into my mind. So the first thing that I actually am gonna say is gonna be a front lip. Now, this wasn't necessary for me to do this for the video, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it for the video. And why I believe a lip is one of the best mods to do to your car is because honestly, a lip changes the complete look of your car. It makes it look 10 times more aggressive, 10 times better. And there's multiple that you could look up. Just look up Civic X front lips. You'll find multiple kinds for all different kinds. Cause I know that there's multiple kinds of front bumpers for the Honda Civic. So you'll find various for each bumper. Uh, and again, they're all under 200 bucks so forget the 500 they're mostly all under 200 bucks so why would you think this is a great item to put on your car <laughs> all right now coming in number two i'm gonna go ahead and say a front grill now just like the front lips there's various kinds you can get i currently have one on my car uh, it's the j style one uh the one that i got was under 200 bucks i believe so there you go another item under 200 bucks uh again it changes the whole look of your car they look great and like I said, there's multiple kinds. So literally there's one for your taste. Again, great option. All right, now moving on to number three, I'm gonna go ahead and say some lowering springs. Yes, that's right, lowering springs. The reason why I'm saying lowering spring is one, because I am currently running lowering springs. And two, because it's a great way to lower your vehicle for under 500 bucks. Again, I got my setup for about 300, I believe. Uh, Yes, it's not adjustable as coilovers, uh, but it is way more affordable and it's a great way to get into, you know, lowering your car and stuff if you're new to this. Uh, don't don't be shy, don't be scared to do something that might be different because I know springs, not a lot of people run, run springs, lowering springs, they mainly gravitate towards, you know, coilovers, but don't let that be a reason why you don't do it. Just go ahead and do what makes you happy. So number three, it's gonna be lowering springs. All right, and coming in at number four, since we're already on the topic of suspension, I'm gonna go ahead and say a rear sway bar. Now, this is not something that I'm personally running on my vehicle, but it is definitely something that is on my list to get. Uh, if you don't know what that is, basically it's supposed to help your, your body roll in your vehicle to kind of lower that down, better cornering, you know. I think it's a great mod to get uh, or to consider at least. Again, it's actually gonna be under 200 bucks, I believe. Uh, I was doing some, you know, some research on a couple brands and they all seem to be about under 200 if I'm not mistaken. So again, another one for under the 200 club, that's already three. So yeah, you can't beat that. All right, all right. Now, before I get to my top one, the one that you all wanna hear, I know, I know, relax. I wanna give one honorable mention. Now, this one is not under 500 bucks. It is a bit more. Um, so this is why I'm not gonna include it, but I am gonna include it in an honorable mention. And what it is gonna be actually a K tuner. Uh, again, this is not something that I am running. I personally don't think I'm gonna get one of these just because I really don't care about making my car any faster. Uh, but if you, that's you, K tuner, go ahead and do that. Cause I heard there's a lot of things you can do with that and it makes your car a lot better. So if that if that's something that you're interested, go ahead and check that out. Um, yeah, so honorable mention, k -tune. All right, and coming in at number one. Can I get a drum roll, please? A steering wheel. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and say a steering wheel simply because, <sighs> me personally, again, it's a mod that I have. Uh, if you've seen any of my past videos, you will see I have a detachable uh, quick release uh, steering wheel. And the reason why I want to include this is because honestly, I feel like it changes your whole driving experience. Uh, I don't know. It's just having, just feeling that steering wheel for the first time when you're so used to your regular steering wheel, it just changes everything for you. 
personally, I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. it makes you feel like you're driving a race car. I know you're driving a Honda Civic. I get it, but you like to pretend, don't you? <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, yeah. So I think I don't know. The steering wheel just does it for me. It really, it really does. It's like I don't know. It's something nice to look at. It feels great. It just makes me feel. I get. I don't know. Better. <laughs> Well, guys, there you have it. My top five mods for the Honda Civic under 500 bucks. Uh, I think it's a pretty solid list. If you guys went ahead and had anything in common or anything that, you know, you weren't thinking about, but you saw this video and you're like, you know what? I want to go ahead and do that. Go ahead and give a thumbs up. Uh, hey, don't forget to share this video to all your other Honda friends just so they could see what, what mods they could get themselves, you know? Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did agree with my list, Go ahead and like I said, leave a thumbs up. And if you guys didn't, you know what? Go ahead and go down in the comments and let me know what you think are the best top five. And who knows? Maybe you have something in your list that I missed that I might think is better and I might go ahead and buy it. So yeah, until the next video, I'll catch you guys then.